So we're about to get underway in this matchup. Maybe a show of sportsmanship to start things off. Well, you always love to see a match start off this way, but apparently we're not going to get good sportsmanship. Byron, is this what you would consider mind games? Well, it sure seems like it. I'm not sure it's going to work, though. And as we just saw, emotions are clearly at a high in this one, guys. Yeah, well, this business isn't about making friends, Cole. Sometimes you have to draw a line in the sand and let others know, I'm not your friend, pal. It's not pretty, but it's effective. Staved off that attack. Heading back to the ring. Inflicted. Oh, straight forward. And over the top into a rough landing. I don't care how much they can fly. All the way to the outside. It doesn't matter if you're on the outside of the ring. There is no place. On the top. Oh, God. That, that, that's a bad landing. My goodness. That did not go as planned. Might have been a bad plan to begin with. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring. No. Suicide dive. Just exhibiting their fearlessness. Exhibiting guts and accuracy as well. Two. Close line. Bree is unable to stop any attack. Nikki Bella is being smart and not letting up. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. And she slides her back to the mat. Nikki Bella flexing her power. And a rack attack. 2.0. Nikki might decide it right there. Two. And now we're about to do it, folks. Here is your winner, Nikki Bella. You hate to see it after a hard this is what I've been telling you and Saxton all along, Cole. It doesn't have to be pretty as long as you win. Sure, they were disrespectful earlier on. They won. In fact, it was that mindset that most likely drove them to win. Nikki Bella clearly feeling fearless. 